Next in CSS, we are going to see image reflection. So here is our uh, emit code and here within body section, we are using image img src equals to as my image is located in same folder, so I'm directly giving the name p.jpg. So this thing is going to bring image on our web page. So this is our image which is too big. Now we have to set its uh, width and height. So for that we are going to head section and here we are giving style tag. And within this style tag, we are, as we are doing it for image, so I am writing image here. Now I am setting its width to 200 pixel. We don't need to set height because if you set both width and height, it is going to uh, deteriorate that image. If we have set the width, it will set its height accordingly. Save it and uh, so this is our image right now. To bring this image in the center, we have to use display to block and uh, margin to auto. So this is our image to so bring it a little down or we can give, say if you want to give top margin so margin top yeah i'm giving this 20 pixel that is not going to increase much or uh, will be almost same so it has come a little down now we are going to work with image reflection so for that here we have to use web kit box reflect box reflect this is deprecated but still we can use it it has different values these values are also deprecated first of all we are using below we want image to be uh, to appear below that image uh, reflection to be up, to appear below that image at, at a distance of 10 pixel after a distance of 12, uh, 10 pixel. So this is our uh, image which is below our uh, image. If we want to increase the distance, we can say it is 20 pixel. So gap will be 20 pixel. And if we put it 0, then it is totally stick. Same way we can, here I am putting 10. And instead of below, I'm saying above. Save. So images above this image, we can see it here. Next is left. So reflection will appear left side to this image. This is our reflected image. And if we put here right, reflection will appear on the right side. Next, we want that image should appear below, but image should not be a full image of this tree. So what we can do here is, instead of right, yeah, I'm giving below. And uh, 10 pixel fine. Here we have to put linear gradient. And within bracket, transparent. So here we can say 60%. And uh, white. Because our background is white, we can put white. If it is of different color, we can put different color. 40%. Save. So we can see that uh, uh, it is showing 40% uh, of its image, total image. 60% is totally transparent. Save it. And uh, this is our image. 